How to end a relationship with a narcissist. Hey everybody, welcome to Narcissist and Karma channel. Today, we are going to discuss how to end a relationship with a narcissist. Make sure to watch till the very end to find out all you need to know about the abundance mindset. Also hit the subscribe button and notification bell for more videos like this if you haven't already. Amidst the hardest things common to humans, one thing that stands out is leaving a narcissistic relationship. This can be draining to one's mental and emotional health. A narcissist is an individual that has a narcissistic personality disorder, which connotes this person has a personality trait of attention, seeking exclusively, looking onto others for their self-esteem regulation, excess pride of oneself, impaired empathy, and meaningless relationships. The worst part of these traits is they are not controlled or subdued through the use of drugs or individual development. These traits are stable over time a narcissist would always want to receive positive feedback about themselves, manipulating others just to coerce self-admiration from them. They will always reflect a type of habitual interpersonal self-esteem regulation. Narcissists solely depend on the people they drain financially, psychologically and emotionally. They always need someone to manipulate to fulfill their urge and continue the circle of displaying themselves as better, exceptional smarter and stronger than any other person. One factor that hinges people from breaking free is a narcissist will not want to leave the relationship, especially if they aren't done with abusing you emotionally and psychologically. Already, you would be exhausted from the continuous battles, the love bombing and manipulation. That ending the narcissistic relationship would become very difficult. Yet it is still possible, even though it might not seem like it. As long as you believe in yourself and mount firm boundaries and tell yourself the reason you need to walk away. If you have been searching for a way to leave the abusive narcissistic relationship, you're in luck. I will walk you through the steps you can follow to make sure you get out of a narcissistic relationship. Here we go. No more giving of chances. First off, you need to know that the next chance they get or that you give to them won't change them a bit. A narcissist will always possess that trait, no matter what the doctor's research stated that it takes about seven times for an individual to leave or end an abusive relationship, because when you think you have left them for good, they come running back, seducing you back into their arms just to dump you again. Because even if you accept them back, it will still be on the narcissist's terms, especially if they are physically violent, which might cause more harm to you. Just as I said earlier, a narcissist won't want to leave you if they aren't ready to leave the relationship yet. They'd probably do a teary apology, but you should never risk giving them another chance because that will be to your detriment. They will always hurt you again or might end it, so don't be generous with your chances of forgiveness. Don't denounce to them you are leaving. This is very vital to end the relationship because when you do otherwise, it can be a failed course. Telling the narcissist that you are leaving could blow things up and eventually make things worse. You should never tell a narcissist that you are leaving them or trying to end the relationship the right way or following the right process to break it off. It might make sense to leave the relationship without telling them. But when a narcissist gets a glimpse that you are leaving, they start bombing you with love. So they can trap you emotionally to stay in the relationship. Or they can become more toxic and have intentions to damage your well-being totally. And your reputation Make sure to have a copy of all your documents. This might not hold water in your mind. But it's one way a narcissist can hold you down to the relationship. Though it is not legal to take one's passport away, a narcissist doesn't care. Making a copy of all of your documents is important. Especially if you're from another country because narcissists are fond of taking stuff you deem important to you. When a narcissist does take your documents away, you should track them down to avoid being bound to them apart from making copies. You could also take photos of the documents and upload them to your email and save them there. And make sure to get a hold of official information that will aid you in leaving the relationship have spare cash with you. Leaving a narcissist means you would be alone fending for yourself. You need to make sure you can fend for yourself. At least before you get something done to gain a steady income. Before leaving, Make sure to open up an account with the bank. This will help store some cash that will be needed. You need to have some money of your own so you won't be tempted or seduced to come back. And if you are going to open an account and store up money, 
it would have to be done in secret, especially if they are financial abusers, because if they find out, they will cut off all finances that flow to you, which will worsen the already bad situation reports to a professional. What has happened to you? Seeking professional help is also a bold step. Help from doctors has been underrated so much. Meanwhile, it could be of so much benefit. Some people feel meeting with the doctors can blow up the situation, thereby endangering them more than before. But these steps are quite important. Even meeting with the police can be of major help. But if you don't want to involve the legal system, you can always then report it to your doctor. When you're about to tell your doctor or the police about the narcissistic relationship, make sure to first say this sentence, I need your help, I'm in an abusive or narcissistic relationship, and I was advised to talk to my doctor, even if your doctor isn't trained in domestic violence or abusive relationships, they have a glimpse of what to do, or better still, you can be referred to a specialist. You need to understand that seeking help is not a taboo or a sign of weakness. It is a bold step to your freedom that shows how courageous you are. And when the case is recorded, it helps build a case in the future and stands as evidence for you cease from every social media app and check your devices for trackers. Social media is known for its public display of an individual's growth and lifestyle. And this can be a way for your narcissistic partner to spy on you. This can be harmful to one who has just left a narcissistic relationship. Especially when you are logged onto the narcissist partner's device, it would be best to log out on all devices you know to have touched because with it they can trace and track whatever you were doing just so you won't miss out on any devices you logged in to make a list of all the devices and sites you opened, then cut across to sites you have input your current details and autofill password. Make sure to delete them, wipe the slate clean. You can also purchase a burner phone that lasts longer without recharging. It's also important to check your devices for trackers because a narcissist won't want to lose control over you and hence try to monitor you all around at times. They make use of a remote access tracker or ways to notice if you are being tracked, is if your phone keeps reducing drastically, or when your Kindle says this book was last read yesterday on someone else's MacBook, which means someone is tracking whatever you read, don't fall for their flattery. Narcissists are known for their extremely flattering words. It's a trap to tame you down in a relationship. You should know you have a choice and can decide not to continue with the relationship, while some may flatter you with words others might even abuse you more to make you not have confidence in yourself enough to leave the relationship. What a narcissist would do is to design an environment that is all you ever wanted and can't do without this way. It becomes difficult to quit the relationship because of fear, fear of what life outside the relationship could be. This thought shouldn't weigh you down in a narcissistic relationship because you have a choice and you know that there is more to life than the four walls of an abusive relationship. Reconnect with your family and your friend's trust is hard to come by connecting with people you can trust and confide in is very helpful and can go a long way in ending a relationship with a narcissist. A narcissist will want to cut you off from every relative and friend you have or any individual you trust, thereby leaving you alone in this horrible situation. With no one to turn to though the narcissist must have made you turn away from your family and friends by lying to turn you against them because they all want you to themselves. No matter how long it has been since you've seen or connected with your family, you shouldn't feel ashamed or nervous about reconnecting with them. Just throw away your pride and call or check up on them. It's not your fault that you were tamed in a narcissistic relationship. You were tricked into doing their bidding. When you open up to your loved ones, you'd be surprised how they have so long to connect back with you and how they have always wanted to help. But we're in the dark on how to make sure not to rush into anything after quitting a narcissistic relationship. It's advisable not to rush into any relationship. So soon because people tend to date people similar to their previous relationships, so it's best to heal from your pain from the previous narcissistic relationship to avoid getting hurt again. When your healing process is complete, you would have a better idea of the kind of person you wish to date or be in a relationship with. With that, we have come to the end of today's video. We hope you enjoyed it. Let us know your opinion in the comment section. Please share and comment on our amazing videos. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel to notify you when a new video like this is out immediately. Have a great one, guys.